So in this video today, um, I will be showing you guys my recipe for homemade dog food. This is what I feed my French Bulldog. His name is Bentley. He's actually right here. Say hey, Bentley. Say hey. So then he's hungry, so let's get started. But before we begin, can y'all please do your girl a favor? Go down below, hit that subscribe button, subscribe. I So first things first, I got the instant pot on saute and I'm browning the brown turkey. Get it nice and brown. Okay, so the meat is brown, that's a brown turkey. Then I put some Atlantic salmon in there and some chicken thighs. Four of them, I'm gonna pressure cook this, but I'm gonna put the potatoes in real quick. This is salmon oil, it's good for their skin, and it has omega fatty acid, so fish oil, salmon oil, just give them like two teaspoons. Um, it's like one teaspoon per 10 pounds. Okay, so now I'll put three eggs in there. And then I'm gonna put the shells too and throw them in the oven real quick. 350 so they can get crispy. Then I'm gonna blend them up and throw them in there. Because we get the dog, the shell, and the air. Back. I gotta stir. It's hard to stir with one hand. <laughs>
<laughs> a little bit of broccoli and cauliflower, sweet potatoes, no salt. That's the key. You have to remember when you add canned veggies, no salt added, as well as your beans, no salt added. The extra salt is just not good for them. That's why it's really not good for them to eat more food. Um, we add blueberries in there as well. Um, it helps with their. It's good for them and it's a nice little snack and it helps them stay looking young. Um, keeps the puppy face so their face is going through. Um, so that's the, the key to the blueberry secret ingredient. And then the rice. Once we add all this, we will pressure cook this for about 20 minutes or so and we'll have it. So let me get back to this. Oh, let me check on my eggs. They are nice and brown. Close it. Make sure that the steamer is closed. As soon as the vent for the steam, you gotta close it. Make sure that's closed. Alrighty, we're gonna pressure cook. 25 minutes. Ooh. So now we just let it do its thing. We'll be back and we'll come back and stir it after 25 minutes. Boom. We are in action. Here we go, guys. So the dog food is all done. I still got a little bit in there, but I'm putting in a separate bowl for them to eat during the week. This I'm gonna put in the freezer. So I put a date on it and then we get frozen. So now we're back in action. We got this frozen. Boom. Get that in there. All right, so this is how we prep Bentley's dog food. So we got the food we just made in the bowl right here with the date on it. I'll give them two scoops. Now, mix it with this hard food called Nutrisource. Um, just because um, he's still a puppy and I'm kind of weaning him off the hard food. So, I mix it up just a little bit. So, now I'm going to put the and normally I'll throw blueberries on top of this, but I put them all into the Instapot. So right now I don't have any fresh ones, but I buy more. Usually I just throw a few on top. Those or carrots, you could throw celery, either one. Just add a nice little surprise on top for the pup. All right, and look at Bentley. All ready to eat? Eat, eat, come on. <laughs> Here we go, see if he likes it. So he likes it. Mmm, good food. Mm. Voila, there you have it, you made out food. One of my recipes, I have a video. 
stay tuned for the next episode. Bye-bye.